Okay everyone, so in this video we're gonna learn how to connect a Namesheep domain to your Blogger account in 2021, alright? So to do this, we need to go to Blogger, just log into your account, and after that we're gonna go to the left sidebar, go down and click on Settings, alright? Under Settings, we're gonna go down to this one, Publishing. Now we can see that we have this uh, blogspot.com domain. So we got andreaswatts.blogspot.com. We want to add our custom domain from Namesheep. So to do this, we're gonna go to custom domain, click on this one. All right, so now we see custom domain. We can either buy a domain right here, but we want to connect a domain from Namesheep. So we need to go to namesheep.com if you don't have a Namesheep domain already, you find the link in the description. And also disclaimer, this link is an affiliate link. That means I will get a small commission if you buy through my link. All right. So when you have your account set up, we're going to go right here to this one account. We're going to go down to this one domain list. All right. So here you have your domain list. I'm going to use this one, andreaswatts.com. To the right of this uh, domain, we're going to go to this one, manage. Click on that, and now we're gonna go to this one, Advanced DNS, click on that. Okay, so just go and copy your domain. Go back to Blogger, and we're gonna add www. and your domain. So www.andreaswatts.com. After that, we're gonna go and click on Save. Okay, so now we got this error message. We're gonna get some information from this error message and add in Namesheep to connect our domain to Blogger. All right, so first we're gonna go to this one, uh, name. We're just gonna copy www. We're gonna go back to Namesheep and we're gonna go to uh, host records. We're gonna go to this one, add new record and go down and click on this one, see name record. Okay, as host, we're gonna paste www. All right, as target, we're gonna go back and we're gonna copy this one destination so ghs.google.com. Copy that, go back and paste it right here. So make sure it's ghs.google.com after that go to the right and click on this green check mark to save changes okay so now we have cname record in place go back to blogger go to the second one so we got name and we got this one so this is unique for your blogger account you will not have the same as i do all right now go to advanced uh, dns in namesheep just go to this one and click on add new record. Uh, choose the same one, C name record. After that, we're going to go to host and paste it right here. So we have this number and letter combination. After that, go back to blogger, go to destination and copy this text. Like so. Now go back to Namesheep and go to target. Paste it right here. Go to the right and click on this green check mark. Save changes. And that's it for Namesheep. Now we're going to go back to Blogger and we're going to go and click on Save. Okay, so after you have saved it, you will see your domain right here under Custom Domain. So we got uh, www.andreaswatts.com. We can also go down to this one, redirect domain from andreaswatts.com to www.andreaswatts.com. If you want to do that, just go and check this one, like so. So it may take up to one hour or more before the settings has applied and you can go to view blog and go to uh, this address, your custom domain. So if it doesn't work right now, just wait. So let's go and have a look. I have waited for maybe 15 minutes 
So I'm gonna go and click on view blog like that. Now we can see that we have andreaswatts.com as my custom domain on Blogger. Okay everyone, so comment below if this uh, video worked for you. Also subscribe for more of these videos. Have an awesome day, take care and bye.